Sometimes the most profound journeys begin not with a destination, but with a return. This was the case for me as I found myself at Berlin's bustling airport, a place that once felt like home. The years have passed, the world has changed, and so have I. Okay, I've just left my hotel um, for my short stay in Berlin this time. And we're heading to Albania, to a place called Tirana. So I'm just on the way to the airport, train station to meet both of my friends. One who's just flown in, so that's very exciting. And none of us have ever been there before. So I'm gonna hire a little scooter, scoot to the train station get on our way. Together with two friends, the kinds whose bonds are tightened by shared roads less traveled, we embarked on a new adventure. Here we are. Here we are at the uh, airport. Yeah. And, uh, I don't know. What have you been doing here? Uh, you know, hanging out. I uh, had a sandwich. was not very good. Kind of spicy. Uh, had a little coffee. Bit of Bori B. Pretty good. Bori B. Ooh, do you think they do like taste it? Yeah. Should we should we taste? I guess so. Why not? One in Rome, right? Our spirits were high, fueled with the anticipation of the unknown, as our plane cut through the skies, bound for Tirana, Albania. On a bus. On a bus. Tirana was a brief stop in our nomadic itinerary, just one night, but even the shorter stays hold the promise of novelty and excitement. We checked into our surprisingly spacious apartment, a modest yet perfect haven for weary travellers, costing us merely 40 euros for the entire night. And split three ways, that's a bargain. As twilight embraced the city, we ventured out to a local gem recommended by our host, Lyft, a rooftop restaurant tucked away from the usual tourist paths. No cameras were allowed here, so the only moments captured were our own memories, leaving the flavors, laughter, and rooftop views. It was a night where cuisine and conversation intertwined under the starlit sky of Tirana. Morning came too soon, and with it, the next leg of our journey a bus ride to Budva, Montenegro. Though our time in Tirana was brief, the city left its mark on us. Each step in a new city, each shared smile, and a new horizon in a thread in this moment of our lives. Travel in its essence is more than a crossing of geographies. It's an exploration of self. With each journey, we step not just into new lands, but into the deeper realms of our own spirits. We travel not just to see the world, but to see ourselves reflected in it, in ways we've never imagined before. As the road stretches before us, I find myself pondering, what reflections will we find in the next city? What stories will we tell? The journey continues, and with it, our search for meaning, connection, and perhaps a glimpse of our own elusive horizons. So join us as we continue this journey. And don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you next time. Keep on adventuring.